All right, next up we have File Plume. All right, we're going to be taking a look at some interesting facts about Vile Plume. So for Vile Plume's information, his weight is 18.6 kilograms, his height is 1.2 meters, he is a grass type and a poison type, his abilities are chlorophyll and effects 4, which is its hidden ability, his catch rate is 45, which is also 11.9%, it evolves from gloom when exposed to a leaf stone, and it is one of Oddish's final forms. The other being Blossom, so that's pretty cool. And for its Pokedex entry, Vileplume's Toxic Pollen Triggers Atrocious al al Allergy Attacks. That's why it is advisable never to approach any attractive flowers in a jungle, however pretty they may be. So you better watch out because Vileplume's going to end up poisoning you. Now for Vileplume's gender difference, the only gender difference is that the female has larger spots, and on the male, there are shorter spots. Plus, there's also a couple of other spots on the male, and fewer on the female. Now, when it comes to Vileplume being in the TV series, he's made three major appearances. So, a Vileplume appeared in Holy Matrimony in a major role. The flower Pokemon was owned by James's fiance. Jezebel. It reappeared in The Treasure is All Mine when Jezebel used it to open up a blocked passageway. While it looks like that Vileplume made a great appearance, and a Vileplume appeared in Mewtwo Strikes Back under the ownership of Nisha. It was uh, among the Pokemon that were captured and cloned by Mewtwo. The Vileplume clone was seen again in Mewtwo Returns. Nisha's Vileplume reappeared in Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution a remake of Mewtwo Strikes Back, where it played the same role. So it looks like Vileplume had a great role in Mewtwo Strikes Back. And a Vileplume appeared in the Stun Spore Detour. Ash, Tracy, and Jesse were affected by its Stun Spore, forcing Misty, James, and Meowth to look for some Salvayo weed and herbal medicine capable of curing Stun Spore. While it looks like that they needed to cure the stun spore by getting that medicine. Alright, so here is Vile Plume's shiny form. So for his shiny form, his body turns a green color with some orange flower petals, which is a pretty nice shiny, I would have to say, and it's much better than Gloom's shiny. And here is the QR code if you ever want to register him into Pokemon Sun and Moon or Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Oh, and here's another fact that you didn't know about Vileplume, is that Vileplume shares its category name with Bellsprout and Blossom. They are all known as the Flower Pokemon. Wow, it's pretty amazing that uh, Vileplume makes a great flower there. Way to go, Vileplume!